best PC cleaner software Windows 10 2021 hello and welcome to easy tech geek today in this short tutorial we will learn about the world top product and please make sure that you watch the whole video and also recommend to your family and friends if you like the video so m there are millions of people actually using this cleaner and most of them do not know how to utilize it to the fullest to make the whole computer in a brand new way once you perform all these steps trust me the performance of your computer will be way better than earlier and you can recommend others as well so it will not take too much time I'll just quickly let you know how to download and install which will hardly take some seconds and then I'll tell you the tools what exactly we need to do it so here the cleaner software is CCleaner, world known program. Still, there are many things which people do not know about this. It is a very powerful program, yet very light. Doesn't take too much resources. So I'll just open Google and type CCleaner download. Here, we just have to go for the top result and look for the free you do not have to pay for it um, I mean you can buy it but I would recommend if it's working for you don't have to pay for it it's completely up to you just download the free you download and once you install it it will look like this and one more thing while installing this C cleaner do not install any additional program so there will be a check mark to install any other browser or any health cleaner etc along with the bundled product do not do that. do that so just install the CCleaner so once you install it this it will look like this so here it has health check custom clean registries tools and options so the very first option is health check uh, I don't do it what I do I'll let you know you just have to do a custom scan analyze it and once it is analyzed you just have to run cleaner I have already optimized my computer I always do it uh, on every third or fourth day so my computer is absolutely fine it doesn't have too much junk or bad files so it has analyzed you just have to run it once you click on run it will automatically clean it that's the first thing there are three more important things which we will be doing in this video which will make sure that whatever the reason of your slow performance of the computer has will be fixed so this is done the custom clean now we will go to registry scanner so it's actually deleting it so we will just wait for a while or I'll just cancel it now the registry why we do not uh, why we want to delete the registries actually so what happens when we install any software or when we perform anything to uh, in the windows like opening browser closing browser opening any software it creates some files it creates some registries and let's say if we are in uninstalling or deleting something it also creates registry so this is why it is very important to delete all those registries from the computer so once we go to the registry tab we just need to run a scan and it will check all the bad registries or unwanted registries we just have to scan it and uh, let's say if it's done uh, it's almost done it's pretty fast so it has selected almost um, 15 or maybe 10 to 12 uh, registries but I have found many computers have more than thousand more than 10,000 registries sitting in the computer making the whole computer slow so I'll just review the selected item if you want to take take a backup of these registries you may do that I don't do it I just click on no and I'll just click on fix all selected issues so this is done now the most important step which we are going to do is so we have already done the custom clean registries here is the very important part the tools which I was talking about this is such a powerful yet very light program I'll let you know why it has 
So firstly, it has uninstall tab, software updater, startup. In the uninstall tab, make sure, just uh, check what all applications you want and what all you do not want it. So just click on it and either uninstall or delete. My recommendation will be always uh, uninstalling the product, any of the application which you do not use it and don't know about it. That's the first thing you can do it. The second, uh, I'll just uh, skip this software updater, the startup one. This is a very um, critical part, the startup one. When we turn on the computer, there are some programs which are associated in the startup menu. So I use Photoshop, I use uh, BlueJeans, which is a, you know, um, meeting software but I do not want it in the in my startup like when I turn on turn on my computer I do not want it in my startup so what I'll do is I'll just disable it so Adobe Bridge is actually disabled and just look for everything whichever like I do not want OneDrive I can simply delete it or disable it so in this manner you actually you're actually decreasing the load of the PC. So once we are done with the startup, we need to go to disk analyzer. Here you can simply analyze and run it. That's not I mean you can do it. I don't do it. So the startup is done. The third is drive viper. Here there are two options free space entire space. Uh, you just need to select free space only and you can select any of the drives so it will only wipe out the cache of those data so what it says securely erase the content or free space on a drive so when it says securely it doesn't touch your data actually so once I'll select free space only that means whatever the data I have in my drives that will not be deleted only the junk and cache so I'll just select free space and whatever the drive I want to select so wipe out. So this is all in one program. Like you have, you have successfully deleted the registries. You have successfully really uh, deleted the junk, and the startup items have been also disabled. You have uninstalled many programs. So you actually have removed all those unwanted things from your computer, and now your computer must be feeling very light. So if you think that this video is useful, please do subscribe my channel. I need your support and you have a wonderful day. Take care guys and please also check my description where I have mentioned some recommendations.